Let's go on a 30-day journey with me talking about health, carnivore diet at 47 years old, 19.2 pounds, gone. All right, guys, I made a commitment last week and I was going to start doing three types of videos on this channel. And I'm going to try to do this as a Monday, Wednesday, Friday thing. I want to do health on Mondays, wealth on Wednesdays, faith on Fridays. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run in here and I'm going to show you some results from the scale. And I'm going to show you how I lost 19.2 pounds in the last 30 days. Not only that, I'm going to share with you a, a diet called the carnivore diet, which blew my mind after I went down the rabbit hole and I decided to jump into it. Now, I can tell you there are some health benefits. There are some things that will just blow your mind and it is excellent for weight loss. I did barely any exercise. I did do some push-ups every day. I did 50 push-ups a day. But uh, other than that, I did no exercise because I hurt my ankle and I couldn't walk. I started walking and then I hurt my ankle somehow and it's been bothering me. So I haven't been even walking or anything. All I've been doing is some push-ups and that's it. So I'm gonna share with you some things on my desktop. I'm gonna pop in and out from my desktop so I can give you guys a good look at what I'm actually doing and why you should give this a try. Don't listen to all the haters out there because anybody that says this doesn't work is somebody that hasn't given a, a shot for at least 30 days. And I can tell you, I haven't had one gram of sugar in 30 days. Now I did have some cravings and all that stuff and we'll talk about that here in a few minutes. But uh, guys, this is my health journey. Let's jump into my desktop so I can show you some of the behind the scenes stuff. Who to follow, how to get started in this, and what to actually do during the carnivore diet. All right guys, let's talk about my journey in the carnivore diet. Now, on New Year's Eve, December 31st, 2021, I decided to, to, to write down some things that I wanted to improve in my life. Health was my number one thing. I gained 30 pounds during the whole pandemic and it just, it made me feel horrible. So health, faith, family, income streams, we're all part of it. So wealth. So what I decided to do is change it up on my YouTube channel and kind of go through three categories, health, wealth, and faith. I want to share my journey through health with the carnivore diet, whatever that turns into into the future. I don't know. Maybe I add some foods and so on and so forth. I don't know. But right now I'm doing the carnivore diet. I've been doing it since January 1st. I'll share my results here shortly. And then I'm going to talk on Wednesdays about wealth building. That's what I've been doing on this channel for a long time. Uh, online marketing, trading Forex, um, all that kind of stuff learning new ways to do things, giving you some tips and tricks, all that kind of stuff, okay? So I'm gonna be sharing that stuff on Wednesdays and then Fridays, I'm gonna go through my faith, okay? So I made a, I made a goal to, to start studying the Bible, okay? I'm, I'm a new believer and I used to believe and then I fell out of it as an adult and now I'm back. So I wanna bring Jesus into my life and I wanna go through that journey and I wanna share it with you guys. So every Friday, I'm going to go over what I learned from Monday through that Friday and kind of go over and review that part of the Bible. I bought a Bible. I got a NLT Bible, a New Learning Translation Bible, and I'm going over uh, the New Testament first, and then I'll, I'll go through the rest of it. But this is what I'm doing. I'll show you who I'm sharing, uh, learning with, and all that kind of stuff. So this is what I'm doing and I want to talk today about my health and the carnivore diet, okay? Now, the carnivore diet is very simple. You eat meat, eggs, and butter with salt. That's it. This is it. High-fat meats, not lean meat, high-fat meat, eggs, butter, and salt. Now, I do add some pepper on every once in a while. Now, that the reason why it's so limited, this is a elimination diet, okay? It, it cures a lot of 
uh, problems, that cure Crohn's disease and diabetes and all kinds of other uh, autoimmune issues and stomach problems, GI issues. That's why they cut out all seasoning. Now, about the last week or so, I started adding pepper and my, my body's fine with adding pepper. I add a little bit of pepper to my steak and a little bit of pepper to my eggs. Other than that, I'm eating salt and meat. I mean, I've even gotten comfortable frying uh, or grilling chicken legs and thighs and wings with just salt. It's actually pretty good. and <laughs> You should give it a shot. But this is what you eat. We, we keep it very simple. All right. And we'll go through more depth. Uh, of, of this kind of stuff as the weeks go by and progress. But I want to give you my results. But I'm going to jump straight into my results, okay? On January or December 31st, I weighed myself that night before I went to bed. I was 206 pounds, 0.6 pounds, okay? This was not the highest I've ever been. I, the highest I've ever been was 205, okay? Now, I started carnivore, and you can see what happened. So January's carnivore month. So I decided to jump into it. And I can say nothing but great things have happened to me. 181 pounds. 19.2 pounds lost. This was January 30th. This morning, 844, I weighed myself 181.4 pounds. I, I, I weighed this yesterday. So that's kind of a bummer. I try to weigh myself every morning. And... uh Sometimes I forget in the morning, I'm like, oh crap, and I weigh myself in the afternoon, so I don't even know if I screw myself up, because usually you're way, high, you're way more in the afternoon, so I always try to weigh myself first thing in the morning after I pee, and I just strip down and weigh myself, okay? 19.2 pounds lost, minus 4.2% body fat, minus 4% body fat so far this month. Now, my goal was 20 pounds this month. I'm close. I got one more day. We'll see where I go. But that's my results. So guys, I hope I'm not overwhelming you too much and I hope you're following along. And if you have any questions, just drop questions in the comments. There are a slew of questions that you're gonna have throughout this process. If you wanna follow my journey, if you wanna join my journey, if you want to have questions or blah, 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 drop them in the comments. If you have ideas that, of things that you want me to talk about in the future videos, Drop them in the comments, guys, okay? I'm going to talk about health, wealth, and faith, okay? These are the topics that interest me, and these are the topics I'm going to talk about on this channel. So if you want to follow me, keep following me, and let's get back to the video. So let's get back to the carnivore diet. How did I find this? Where did it come from? Why did I get into it? One of my first resources here were Dr. Ken Berry. Now, I had a friend that did this for six months. He was diabetic. He got off his diabetic medicine and insulin. He, uh... He had a bunch of issues, joint issues, and they were clearing up. He had some uh, skin eczema that cleared up. So he told me all this and he got really like in shape too during the process. And I was like, man, that's just crazy. I, I, I don't know. I, my, my heart ain't the best heart in the world. I'm, I'm kind of scared of that. And I started doing some research. Okay. This was one of the doctors that I started with. Now you go to YouTube and just type in carnivore and doctors and you're going to get a slew of information. Then you can start digging down the rabbit hole like me, or you can stay with me and I'll, I'll share this stuff week after week and we'll get deeper and deeper and deeper into this. But I want to give you kind of like the, the 30,000 foot view of how I got into this. So I started doing some research with Dr. Kim Berry. Okay. Dr. Kim Berry is a, as a family physician, he's board certified. He's been treating, uh, thousands of patients with obesity, diabetes, and all that stuff for, for years, okay? Now, he's got a YouTube channel as well and lots of great information. So go search him up. Uh, again, that's Dr. Kim Berry. The next one is Dr. Sean Baker. Now, he came on the Joe Rogan podcast. I don't know if you listen to Joe Rogan. I'm a, I've been a Joe Rogan fan since, maybe since he started. But, and he came on in 2017 and kind of shook the world up with this whole carnivore thing. Okay. Now, Sean Baker is also a doctor. He started a company called Rivero and basically he, he wants to open people's eyes up to how good this stuff is. Re eliminating plants and plant-based food from your diet and then doing the elimination diet that way. Okay. Now, 
I'm not saying just to go cold turkey straight into meat. Maybe there's there's ways, but we'll talk about that throughout this video. But as you can see here, this this, this is a health benefits, and he goes through all these are, are different science uh, related articles. Okay, and and you can see here we present thousands of peer reviewed scientific articles showing that science and research demonstrate eating meat is essential for human health. Okay, so don't take my word for it. Go check this website out. It's carnivore.diet and go here and just click on each one of these. Okay. So if you wanted to learn a little bit about diabetes, you would go to diabetes, you would go into this and, and then you go to peer reviewed articles and here's some peer reviewed articles. All these are on, on medical web websites. Okay. Talking about the good things that come about eating meat. Okay. So the, do, do your own research and, and figure that stuff out for yourself. Now, Kim Berry, like I said, he's got an amazing uh, YouTube channel. They do him and his wife, uh, Naisha, she, she, they, they do a Q&A every Monday on Facebook and YouTube, a live Q&A. So if you get started in this or if you have questions about getting started, maybe you have like maybe you're maybe you got high cholesterol and you want to ask them a question. Go on there and ask a question and he'll answer it to you live, 6 p.m. Eastern time. Okay, go check that out if you want to get answers from a diet or uh, doctor. Now, this is how it works. And this is from a website. I'm not going to give you a name because they're trying to charge for this and you don't need to charge for this. Okay, 30 days. Give it 30 days. Uh, what I would do if I could do this over, I would get blood work done the day before I started and or the week before I started and then get blood work done a week the day I, I stopped or the day at the 30 day mark to see what my blood work looked like. Now I am getting blood work done at the end of February. So that'd be my, my second month in, but that's what I'm doing. Now, what I would like to challenge you to do is do this for 30 days and just see how it affects you. Just eat meat, eggs, butter, salt. That's it. Okay. Don't make it hard. Make it simple. Do it for 30 days. The number one thing that stops people from losing fat during this or losing any weight is they add cheat meals. They'll be like, oh, this one little cookie isn't going to hurt or this one little thing because you have zero sugar. I have had not one gram of sugar, not one gram of sugar this month, which is crazy for me because I'm so used to eating like a whole, pa whole pound of gummy worms and a pound of Twizzlers and I was the biggest sugar addict on this planet, okay? And if I can do that, I can. anybody can do it. Now, my cravings didn't go away for about two weeks. I don't crave nothing now. I got candy sitting in front of me right now, some Valentine's candy my daughter's got sitting up over here. And I'm not even, like, craving it. That's the crazy part. So, I do have some tips and tricks that I'll share with you, like electrolytes and things like that that you have to get and the salt I use and all kinds of stuff, Okay. We'll go through that stuff later in, 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 the, in future videos. Now, this is another uh, resource, Dr. Anthony Shafee. He's a doctor out of, he's in Australia, practicing in Australia, and he's a rugby player. And you can see he's fit. He eats nothing but beef. Beef and salt. I don't even know if he eats eggs. Okay, so this guy is like hardcore, and he's been doing that for like six years. Okay, now carnivore diet. Now let's keep it simple guys. Okay. I don't want you guys to overcomplicate things. There's a chick on YouTube. Her name is Laura Spath. Laura Spath. She has some great information. She's just a normal chick. Her and her husband lost over 205 pounds combined doing carnivore and keto. Okay. Now she's mainly carnivore, but she goes through uh, she, she travels a lot. So she, what she does is how I order a Jimmy John's, how I order a Sonic. She's got a, a playlist. It's called how I order, what I order. Go check it out because a lot of people are like, man, what if I want to go out to eat? Well, look, she tells you how to do it at Sonic, Chipotle, Chick-fil-A, Applebee's, IHOP, Olive Garden, Texas Roadhouse, Mexican restaurant, Buffalo Wild Wings, Cracker Barrel, in and out So she's showing you ways to do that. Okay. Now she's not going to, she's not going to like tell you not to eat cheese and stuff when you go out to a restaurant, okay? But she shows you how to order like meat, pat, uh, burger patties with or chicken breast with cheese on it, you know? 
there, there, there's ways to do this. And she's a great resource. I mean, she's got some good videos too. Uh, so she's a good resource to follow as well. If you want to go down this rabbit hole with me now, guys, this is the carnivore diet and some tips. If you don't want to just jump dive right in, I'm all in guys. So I have to dive right in. But if, if you want to just start like slow, like take a week and just cut out processed crap, take the next week and cut out starches and take the next week and cut out your vegetables, then you start carnivore. Or you can just be crazy like me and just go all in, get your blood work done and be like, boom, and, and lose 20 pounds in a month. Okay. This is my results of the carnivore diet. And guys, if you have any questions, drop them in the comments down below. And I hope that other people follow me on my journey. And if not, I'll see you on Wednesday and we'll talk about wealth building. We'll talk about ways to make money online. And if not, you want to see my faith videos, just come and see me on Friday. We'll be talking about, I'm, I'm reading the book of Mark right now. So we'll talk about the book of Mark and the Bible and my, my journey of finding Jesus and what I'm doing and the challenges I'm having and all that stuff. Okay. Full transparency. All right, guys. Peace out. Catch you on the next one. See you Wednesday. <laughs>